All right, welcome back to the Knives Fast channel, guys. Say hello to Ren and Stimpy and Patter Test Man, Log TV and Choo Choo, and let's get started with today's video. Okay, so this is this month's SMKW Affiliation Knife, and guys, I am excited to share this review with you. You. What does that mean? I'm an affiliate with SMKW, and you guys are able to use my code SMKW Knives Fast at checkout, one word, and that gets you free shipping. Um, and when you use that code or uh, use my link, which is always down below, um, it uh, the code is the easiest way to do it, guys. Just just use the code, and if you use the code. Uh, then it uh, helps the channel and I get something back and I then turn around and use that to buy a knife uh, to get in to review and to give away on the channel. But we're going to review it right now. This is the Fox Knives and it's not labeled on here, but it's the Yaru. Um, and this is a Vox design. This one is in white storm carbon fiber, but there's also a toxic storm and a purple haze version. It's on uh, its flat scales, chamfered off, black hardware. It is on one side. The other side is titanium uh, with a titanium clip with a ceramic ball. We'll talk about that in a minute. It is not a, uh, uh, um, pfft, uh, whatever the word is I'm trying to get out of my mouth. It does not go way up here. Wow. Um, yeah, I'm blanking. Okay. And it does not reverse, uh, but it's fine. I mean, there's about that much sticking out of your pocket. Uh, brain fart. Uh, so there is your lanyard uh, hole inside uh, the backspacer. Pretty cool looking design, and it is kind of a floating backspacer there. You do have open besides that. Um, and again, that white storm fat carbon is pretty dang cool if you ask me. Now, as you see, we have uh, the Arctic, I mean the Arctic storm, the white storm here. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, again, we have a hole, uh, the typical Vox style hole, and you can get into that very easily. You also have a flipper tab uh, with no jimping, which is really interesting. These are made in uh, Italy by Vox in uh, Mangiano, uh, if I can actually say that right. It is Vanek steel and again, fat carbon, uh, which I think is a pretty dang, all right, come on. All right, we're going to move the box. This is what always happens. All right. Uh, there you go. Uh, very cool combo of Vanex and that fat carbon. Now you have a very typical Vox uh, style blade here. Uh, very beautiful drop point with kind of a harpoon here and a swedge. Uh, you can choke up, but that is a very tight uh, choke up point. I can get four fingers on this guy back here, but just no jimping at all, which is interesting for Vox. You would expect some jimping up here, uh, but there isn't any. Um, and uh, you again, you can choke up and it feels really nice in that choked up grip as long as you kind of trigger back here. It's just, I wish it was a little bit bigger. You do have good sharpening relief, as you can see there. Black uh, wash blade with, uh, you know, quite a bit of, of billboarding there. You got the Vox, uh, the Van, the Vanex, and the Mania, Maniago, what is it? Maniago, Italy. Wow, I still said it wrong. And then the Fox over here on this side. Uh, now, as far as that hole, again, detent is pretty good. It's, it's not like super tight, but it's good for this method here. And then let's just see, since we have two methods of deployment, uh, very good. You can, uh, can't really fail it. Yeah, I guess you can. Uh, you can fail it, but again, if you give it a little bit of gas, it's fine. Now, uh, the elephant in the room, uh, apparently on any Vox knife, uh, I just don't understand. Uh, there is no pass through for lock bar access. There's a small chamfer. Um, it does, by the way, it's a frame lock, so it has an over travel stop and a lock bar interface that are steel. Um, you know, I just wish if there's not going to be a pass through, then just give me a little piece that sticks up to catch my thumb. I, I get it. That's not apparently how he must, uh, close knives. He must just jam his thumb down in there. And I know a lot of people are like, what's the big deal, Jim? And if you're, 
If you're just working with it, that's one thing. If you want to fidget with it, it's not a very fidget friendly uh, thing. I am doing it, but it is definitely beginning uh, to dig into my thumb. Um, you know, is it a big deal? No. Would I still use the knife? Yes. Um, does it feel great ergonomically? Yes. Is there, um, you know, you can feel the pocket clip, but not bad. I mean, it's just not my thing. Now, this particular one is great. Um, a lot of people have asked me, and you guys know I'm always honest, the first one I got came with a ton of lock stick. Um, I cleaned the face and it got a little bit better, but then a little bit later in the day, I don't know if more oil got on it or what happened, but I couldn't, I could not push it over easily. It was so locked. I even had to use two fingers at one point to pull it open. Uh, so I sent it back to SMKW and they sent me this one. This one does not have lock stick. Um, no, no lock stick. Now, as far as lock up, uh, you have about 25% there. You didn't get a good look at that. A um, little bit of side to side. Again, I haven't adjusted this. I like to tell you how it comes from the fact from the uh, dealer. Uh, no up and down at all. It is, yep, dead centered. I had to look off camera. Sorry about that. Very nice. Uh, again, overall, just like all Vox knives, a great design. Now, um, the, the detent could be just a little bit stronger as you saw with the flipper tab, but not bad. And that pass through could be better. Now let's talk about the clip. Uh, the clip is decent, but that, uh, ceramic glide ball, as they call it, which is interesting. Uh, it's just not good in and out of the pocket. It, it grabs now again, it, I am using thinner cargo pants and not jeans, uh, but it gets caught and I have to force it in or wiggle it in or pull it out or any of the, it's just not good, but it, the retention's good. Um, and again, uh, that's what we have. So I don't know. I mean, it's a cool design. It really, really is. I just, I think I wanted it to be great and it's good. Does that make sense? Uh, now these are $200 and there are three versions. Again, the White Storm, uh, the Purple Haze, and, um, Shoot, what was the third one, Casey? The the uh, toxic, uh, toxic storm. So uh, those are your three versions. They are all two hundred dollars. Again, I can get you free shipping with the code knives SMKW knives fast. Um, this one is three point three five inch, uh, three point three five ounces with a three point nine three uh, closed uh, length and a two point seven six inch Van X blade made by Fox Knives in Italy. The, um, it is tip up, uh, titanium only on the one side pocket clip. Uh, da, 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 da. Carbon fiber, of course. Um, I was looking for something else and I don't see it. So we'll just move on. Black coated blade, of course, uh, designed by Jesper Voxness. So again, uh, a really cool knife uh, that just, like I said, to me, is good uh whereas just a couple little tweaks could really make this great and yeah some of you are going to say you're being nitpicky some of you are going to say i can't believe you're nitpicking vox uh who's one of the best designers out there but guys i just you know today's day and age i think people really want to be able to get a good pass through to that lock bar uh, and not have to jam their thumb down in there now if i'm wrong and you don't care about that that's what the comments section is for. So go for it. Uh, let me know uh, that that does not bother you. And uh, that sounds uh, fine to me. So uh, everybody's got their own opinions. And what this channel is, is simply my opinion. Now, as I said, this is this month's SMKW affiliation knife. So do not forget to leave a comment. Um, and that's all I'm going to say. Again, don't publicize the giveaways. I just do them. And, uh, if you're watching this long, uh, remember that and don't forget us addresses only, uh, because there's a knife being, uh, given away. So, uh, there you go. Don't forget to comment and, uh, we'll leave it open for a few days and we'll find us a winner. So there you go, guys. Awesome stuff.
you know, I, like I said, I'm digging the knife. By the way, if you're not subscribed, you need to stick around. Hit that subscribe notification. Uh, go over to Instagram. Go to Knives Fast and follow me there. Uh, and guys, don't forget all the things. Like, comment, subscribe, notification bell. And thank you, SMKW. And thank you guys for using my code. And thanks for watching the Knives Fast channel.